too much. <laughs> My packages came in. <laughs> My tooth is starting back hurting. Hey y'all, so your girl is fresh off of work. We're headed to go pick Solomon up from school and then we have to go take Jamarie to his doctor's appointment. I had called on my lunch break to schedule him a doctor's appointment and luckily they had an opening for today at 3.15. So we're gonna go ahead and get him checked out cause he's just been weak, sleeping, not one to eat, coughing, sneezing, all the things so yeah y'all so anyway if you are new here hey girl hey my name is melva don't forget to like comment and subscribe before you leave and if you are a returning subscriber what's up and if i didn't say today is monday so happy monday you guys and uh yeah y'all keep on watching hey y'all so we've made it to the doctor's office with jamarie and um they took his weight and shh, you are in a doctor's office they took his weight and his temperature so we're currently just waiting for the doctor to get back here sit down sayo everybody had to have a mask on uh, it's terrible around this camp but yeah COVID and the flu is running rampant. Okay. Oh, you see the computer? <laughs> Not too much. It's okay. Other side. Perfect. She got to get your ear right in. She's going to look inside your ear. Right Let's see. So we are out of the doctor's office. We're currently at Chick-fil-A grabbing some food. Uh, well, they swabbed Jamarie for COVID, the flu, and strep throat. And all of them came back negative except the flu. So Jamarie officially got diagnosed with the flu. They... um sent him a prescription for ibuprofen to his pharmacy. But do y'all hear him though? <laughs> um, so I will go pick up his prescription whenever I get the text message or whatever, when it's ready. Why are these folks not moving? Sorry, I fell asleep. But yeah, so. We're basically, oh, we need to get him some um, orange juice so that he can stay um, hydrated. Orange juice, water, apple juice, stuff like that. So, yeah, y'all, we're about to get this food and then we're going to head home. Yes. Hey y'all, so we are back at the house. Child, while we had came to the house and I got the text message that the prescription was ready. So anyway, we had to turn around, go back to the uh, Walmart pharmacy and got the prescription. And then y'all, my packages came in. I got both of them. These more than likely is my boots and then my outfit. So yeah, y'all, I'm happy about that. I'm going to be showing y'all what I got here in a second. I'm about to go ahead and take my shower real quick. And then whenever I get out, I'll unbox the packages with you guys. So yeah, y'all. All right, y'all. So we're about to go ahead and open these packages. I'm in my bathroom because clearly the lighting is so much better in here than it is in my room. So yeah. Ooh. Alright, so these are the 
the bell bottom jeans. I'll have everything linked in the description box just in case you want to try something out for yourself. So yeah, y'all. Here are the jeans, the bell bottom. Ooh, that's what it looks like. Back. I love distressing y'all, like literally. You cannot miss me with a pair of distressed jeans. So, yeah y'all, I gotta try them on to see how they fit. But I'm not doing that right now because I'm about to relax. So, yeah. Uh, oh, relax and edit. I totally forgot I have to edit. Jeez. And here is the shirt. Oh, I love the material. It feels really like silky. So, dang, I feel like I should have got it. But I am gonna, I'm gonna tie it up on the side like that. <sighs> yeah, y'all. Cause I didn't want it to be too tight and I don't want it to be too loose, but loose enough for me to tie it up on the side. But yeah, that's the fit. I could have easily like threw a, uh, one of those little fringe vests on with this. That would have, you know, dazzled it up a little bit more. But I'm not going to do too much. Because I'm not really, you know what I'm saying, with the cowgirl stuff. But, yeah. Go take some shoes off. Okay. And here are the boots. This is... The packaging and uh, let's open these bad boys up. Uh oh, okay, dust bag. Come in, little dust bag. And here's the boot, y'all. What is looking like? What is hidden for? I love them. They look super cute. OMG. These are so cute. These are so cute. OMG. Okay, yeah. So yeah, y'all, that is the rodeo fit. I'm gonna be doing a get ready with me when the time comes. So y'all will see that. Child, Lord knows when, but you know. Yeah, y'all. OMG. I like this boot. With the shirt. Yeah. Y'all see what I did there. Yeah. So anyway, y'all. That's the fit. What's up, y'all? Good morning. It is Wednesday. And we're headed out. I'm about to drop Solomon off at school and head on to work. Joshua usually would have dropped me off at this particular assignment like he did the last two days, but his stomach is not feeling well, so it's just me and Sayo this morning. So yeah, y'all, we're about to head out. Hey y'all, so I am off of work. I am currently at Solomon School waiting for him to come out of the schoolhouse. I see a lot of the kids walking out, but I haven't seen him yet. So I'm about to get down and, um, up, oh, there goes my baby. He walks out with his cousin no matter what, baby, period. And he be looking for us. So let me go get my baby real quick. <laughs> Don't pull from there. Hey y'all, happy Thursday. We are headed on our way out to run a few errands. Y'all, I didn't come back to y'all yesterday because your girl had a migraine and 
it's because of my tooth. My tooth is starting back hurting. And yeah, your girl been out of it. I was in so much pain yesterday whenever I got off of work. I've literally been pushing through for the last three days. And last night pretty much like broke me down, baby. Broke me down. So I called the dentist this morning, gave them my new uh, dental insurance information and everything because baby I was paying out of pocket at first and when I tell you those prices hit you over the head will hit you over the head so hopefully this dental insurance will kick in and you know what I'm saying help you girl out give me a discount something so anyway my appointment is on Monday morning to get the extractions so yeah and I'm like dang it would be happening the day before the rodeo but child either way I, these teeth gotta get up out of here. I, I, I just can't take it no more. It's, it's ridiculous at this point. So, yeah, y'all. We're about to head out. And, uh, I'll check back in with y'all here in a little bit. Oh, y'all see Solomon? Ty. I kept him home because, child, listen. I was up all night. I seen 5.30. Like, Josh even said himself, like, every time he woke up last night, because he kept waking up off and on, checking on me and everything, and every time he woke up, I was up. Like, I didn't... <laughs> I didn't get much sleep. But, yeah, y'all. So, I kept him home, because I, I didn't get no sleep last night. So, yeah. Hey y'all, it is much, much later. In the last clip, I know we were heading out, getting ready to run some errands. Um, I picked up a few things from the dollar store. I got me some Aleve's child because needed that and some Orgel. I think we got some household items as well and that was about it. Uh, we went a few places and came back home because child, it was looking real gloomy outside and looking like it was about to start raining. So I just got done editing and now I checked out my subscription feed and my girl Peyton has uploaded a video. Y'all already know how I feel about Peyton. I don't have to tell y'all every time. I'm about to tune in. Period, poo. About to tune in. So, yeah, y'all. When I tell y'all those Aleves work like a champ, like I choose Aleve over Tylenol any day because... Oh my gosh, like with the Tylenol, I was in so much pain. And with the Aleves, like it knocked the pain completely out. At least it's going to hold me over until Monday when my dentist appointment is, child. So, yeah, I'm I'm ready and waiting. But anyway, y'all, yeah, um, Peyton uploaded. So I'm about to watch her and watch some more YouTube videos. We are literally chilling, y'all. I feel like this vlog has been pretty boring and kind of like... You know, all over the place because I haven't really been vlogging because I have been in pain. And child, don't nobody be wanting to talk whenever, you know what I'm saying, you got a toothache that's like out of this world. So, yeah, y'all. That's why I'm talking to y'all now. So, I'm about to tune in. Oh, y'all, we watched Harriet on Netflix. When I tell you a 10 out of 10 recommend, if you have not checked out the movie Harriet on um, Netflix... That is a must watch. That was so good. And then a few days ago, I watched uh, that Mia Culpa or something, the Tyler Perry movie. Child, look. <laughs> I ain't gonna get into all of that, but if you've seen that movie, then you know. It was good, but it was kind of crazy. And then it had me stuck at the end, like. Yeah. But yeah, y'all. I'm rambling at this point. Y'all see Marie? Say hey, Papa. <laughs> Say hey, Papa. Y'all, he feeling so much better. Say hey. Hey. <laughs> so anyway, y'all, yeah, I'm about to watch Peyton, so I'll holla at y'all a little later. Hey, y'all. So it is the next day, and I just not too long ago got home from work. It's currently like a little after 6.30. I got off at 5.00. When I got here, Princess and Royalty was here. Child, Joshua has been talking about some hobo soup that Princess knew how to make for the longest. And she finally came over and made it. Basically, hobo soup is like whatever you have in your pantry or your cabinets, whatever. 
and you just put it and make it into a soup so she had some noodles she put green beans she put corn she put hamburger meat and I think that was all that she put in there and baby let me tell you I don't try new things I know it's bad when it comes to like food and stuff like that I'll be kind of iffy about trying new stuff listen here that soup pretty much everything princess make is like a one like at this point she got it going out but yes y'all even the kids two olds loved it so um yeah y'all i didn't do nothing else last night like i told y'all um this video is not really just like one that i would usually put out because what the heck i was in pain for three four days and you know i couldn't do all that talking while my teeth was hurting like there was just no way and i had a migraine with it so that was like the icing on the cake but i'm feeling much better thank god but i do apologize for this video not being much and me not really just vlogging or whatever so i'm about to end this one and start fresh with a weekend vlog but if you did enjoy this vlog make sure you give this video a big thumbs up it'll help your girl out a lot and if you haven't already became a male rose go ahead and hit that subscribe button it's free and as always thank you guys for watching and rocking with your girl and i'll see y'all in the next one